It can be pretty terrifying looking at the daily COVID-19 numbers, but lead investigator Brian Duggar says the numbers may not be what they seem for Toledoans. COVID-19 infections have surged more than 30% across the state of Ohio in the past week. But think about these numbers. In Cleveland, Cincinnati, and Columbus, each of those areas have had more than 1,400 cases in the past two weeks. In Lucas County, 140 cases in the past two weeks. And when we think about daily hospitalizations, those numbers are also up about 30% since last week across the state. But Ohio has not reported a confirmed hospitalization in Lucas County in nine days. In Wood County, it has been 10 days. Right now, Southwest Ohio is being hard hit by the virus. When Lucas County and Toledo are surging in April and May, Cincinnati and Dayton were not. But the tide has turned for those cities. Another bit of good news is that despite the overall jump in cases, the state daily death average actually went down one from last week to 16 per day. But as you think about traveling this weekend for the holiday, just know that the virus is still widespread across the state. With so many people traveling and socializing, we're gonna wanna watch those numbers closely in the weeks ahead. One disturbing trend we're seeing is a surge in the current number of hospital patients. Again, this is being driven by outbreaks in Cleveland, Columbus, and Cincinnati. This week, the average has been 695 patients a day in the hospital. Last week, the number was 562. That's a huge jump. Yep, I get it. These big numbers can be pretty scary that come out every day. But keep in mind, we're in pretty decent shape locally. So this weekend, be smart, be responsible. Reporting in Perrysburg, Brian Duggar, WTUL 11.